Hey guys, I have a Dollar Tree haul and a couple of small things that I found at the grocery outlet. Um, and I'm just going to put them together in this video. I'm going to show you what I got at the outlet first. Um, and I thought these were a great deal. They're the Goody 37 piece hair ties. They were only $1.49 there at the outlet. So I got um, two of those ones, one for each of my girls. I'm going to put them in their baskets for Easter. And then I got myself one as well. Um, we go through so many darn hair ties, and these are really expensive at the other stores, so I picked those up. Yeah, and that was all that I'm going to show you from the out the grocery outlet. The rest is from Dollar Tree, and I'm so excited because I found a lot of things that I've been looking for. So, yay! Um, the first thing I found, I've never seen before, the Sherwood truffles, and they had them in hazelnut and, car and caramel, or caramel, however you say it. There's a six in the box, and these do not seem to be a Dollar Tree brand, um, so I picked those up. I'm going to set these off to the side because it's super hot today, and I'm afraid they're going to melt. Um, next thing I grabbed, I got these for my husband and my daughter because they love these. The TGI Friday Jalapeno Cheddar. Every time I buy these, my husband eats the whole bag, and then my daughter's mad that she didn't get any. So I grabbed two for them. And I'm going to get the boring stuff out of the way first. Well, boring in my opinion, anyway. Um, next, they had cheese nips there, the 7 ounce box. And I actually like, sorry, I don't, my hand's making it uh, shaded. I like cheese nips better than cheese it so I saw these there and I went ahead and grabbed two boxes of those. Next, I saw a coupon to provide had hauled these at the Dollar Tree and they're the magnetic doodle board and she um, had, you know, given, uh, what do you, what do you, how do you say it, uh, she had taken it out of the package and showed how it worked, that it worked really well. It's not a Dollar Tree brand. This is made by Toy Investments, Inc. And I bought four of these. I was so excited to find them because um, I think I've told you guys before, I have a ton of kids, little kids in the family. Um, and I'm really trying to get Christmas stuff taken care of early. So I got four of those, which was exciting. Um, next, I found one of these clever wallets in pink. And I got this because I have a crossbody bag and my wallet won't fit in it. So I figured I would just uh, use that. And my store had the white rain. They only had the daily foot and heel cream um, there. And these are paraben free, four ounces. And I grabbed two of those. Next, I finally found the pumice sponge. Yes, Lala, my store finally got them. I've never seen them in person before. And um, so I went ahead and grabbed one for myself. And then Tiff, if you're watching, I remembered you said you couldn't find these. I grabbed one for you. Okay, then next they had these Conair Barrettes um, two-pack. Really cute, silver with the pale pink. And then the, uh, like a rhinestone in the middle. This is what the back of them look like. They had them in gold and silver. And the gold is, um, like a, a beige, like a, what do you call it? Um, like an ivory flower, um, instead of the, the, actually, to be honest, I can't tell if that's a pale pink or a pale lavender. Anyway, I grabbed one of each to go in my gift box for, uh, for the kids at Christmas. Um, next, these I also saw on Coupon to Provide's uh, haul that she did. She found the Curad Sensitive Skin, and these were 100 um, Band-Aids, and they're gentle fabric, comfortable and breathable, um, and they're for delicate skin. I thought these were a great price, and I went ahead and grabbed two of those. And next I grabbed two, or one box, which has two of the extra large storage bags, 
I've never used these before, but I have heard good things, so I decided to pick those up. And next I found pumpkin pie. My store hasn't had this out since last year. And they had a couple of the candles, um, but I went ahead and got the oil this time to see if it's any good. I grabbed that. And I grabbed myself some nail polish remover because as you can see, my nails are horrid. And I didn't have any remover. <laughs> I never paint my nails, so... Um, I've forgotten how easily they can rub off or that the polish comes off. I wasn't too happy. This was the Sally Hansen one at the Dollar Tree, the pale pink color, and I really don't like it. I put numerous coats and it just didn't look good. Speaking of nail polish, I did grab some. Um, I found this one that I haven't seen before in the Milani. It's really pretty park or sparkly pink glitter. It's called Pink Flare number 552. And then next I got the Revlon Colorstay 310 Vintage Rose. And hold on, I'll be right back. 